Welcome to Shep Rambles, where I'm Shep, and I tend to ramble about what? Anything and everything. And today we're going to talk about Wisconsin and schools closed in Wisconsin forever. That's kind of a sad thing. Now, I don't know if it's all of Wisconsin. That title makes it seem so, but it's actually speaking more directly about Arena, Wisconsin. And there is a... Uh, some slides here, some stuff in the uh, arena. So this is the school. It looks kind of abandoned there. But um, it says 10-year-old Lola Roski. I don't know if that's who that is. Uh, grabbed her backpack and headed to elementary school for the last day of class. Um... We can skip some of that stuff here. But she was among the last students to attend Arena Community Elementary. After classes let out last Monday, the school was shuttered permanently by the River Valley School District, whose administrators say that unforgiving budgets, a dearth of students, and an aging population have made it impossible to keep the school open. For the first time since the 1800s, the village of Arena has no school. That's sad. Um... The government really needs to do something about education. It's it. There's a lot of improvement that could be done. Um, Arena Elementary is the second small rural elementary school in two years to close in the district. Nearly 300 square miles of rolling pastures and dairy farms in southwestern Wisconsin. Uh, the one in the neighboring village of Lone Rock closed last spring. The district now has just one open public elementary school in Spring Green nine miles away same scene is playing out across rural america officials in aging communities with stretched budgets are closing small schools and busing children to larger towns people worry about losing not just their schools but their town's future that the closing will prompt the remaining residents and businesses to drift away and leave the place a ghost town that has happened um, I've seen that happen in, in small towns that I love going on road trips and when you go through small towns you kind of see how things degrade it. You see uh, things that have closed and it's, it's sad. Um, and it kind of goes in to hear about major shifts in population from rural areas to cities and suburbs. Arena's last day capped the long and bitter and personal debate that has divided the rural community far more than any political debate. A um, bunch of stuff about residents voting, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Oh, let's see here. It's late where I'm at, so I apologize for uh, yawning a lot. The numbers are there for anyone to see. River Valley School District graduated 105 seniors this year and expects only 66 kindergartners to start in the fall. But the fight over Arena Community Elementary is bigger than the school. A small building where Moody sconces, sconces line the hallways and nod to Frank Lloyd Wright, whose landmark studio, Telesian, Telesian, He's carved into a bluff a 10-minute mile down the road. Well, what is this? Let's take a look. Touring Lloyd Franker Lights. That's kind of cool. That's a neat-looking building. I don't care about the article, but the picture is cool. Uh, residents worry about what will happen to Arena. Population 834 without the school. We kind of went over that over there. There isn't much else in this two-lane stretch of Highway 14, a gas station, a cheese outlet, a cafe called Grandma Mary's. <laughs> There's a place I want to check out. Beloved for its Friday fish fry and beef stroganoff. But the reality of rural life in Midwest, school officials say, is that younger people are fleeing. They want Starbucks and Thai restaurants, plentiful jobs. This here makes sense. 
High speed internet. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Um, when they start families, they want schools with amenities and big thriving athletic programs. In any small community anywhere in this country, our kids grow up and move away. They go to college, you get a job, but it's not here because the opportunity is not here. So who's left here? Grandma and Grandpa. It was hell. Across rural Wisconsin, school administrators facing the same painful trend are having to choose which schools to shutter. Why did they say shutter? Makes me think of that song. Sh oh no, sorry, that's Kiss. Strutter, not shutter. Uh, maybe use the word shut down. I don't know. Well, that's two words. Um, a lot of this is kind of like the same old, same old, same old stuff. Uh, that looks like Mr. Pooch's. <laughs> Submitted his resignations, plans to depart. Um, schools were their life. Yada, yada. Man, this is a... And, and I tend to ramble, but this is kind of going on here. So nobody's moving here. Uh, anyway, it's a sad article. Um, this is what arena looks like. This, this is what it looks like on a map. So as you can see, there's a highway. Just one highway that goes through here. There's a... a a crappy shop <laughs> a crappy shop well I'm not sure why would you want to go to a crappy shop I don't know uh, BP that's gas station here's arena cheese there's grandma Mary's cafe um, that's it where is arena here's spring green Wisconsin so okay so here's Milwaukee so if you from Milwaukee, if you go out this way, Madison, uh, there's Arena. So if you're on a road trip, stop by Arena. Go to Grandma Mary's Cafe. Let's just take a look. I love street maps. Let's just take a look here. Maybe I need to. Yeah, it's the Google. Google truck thing here. All right. So are we facing we're facing north? So this is what Arena, Wisconsin looks like. It's very actually kind of pretty. Actually, very nice and open. It's a thin road. Um, that looks like I don't know cotton. Maybe I don't know. Do they grow? I know they have cheese, but. Let's kind of go, go out here. We're going to take ourselves a little road trip. Street view is great, isn't it? All right, so here is Highway uh, 14. That kind of goes through here. So we've got a uh, water, water tower. gotten kind of dark so there is the gas station we'll kind of move over this way a bit we got something off here on the side what do we have over here north not sure what that is What is this? Fireworm, bait and liquor. All right, there's a cemetery. Okay, and I think we are probably beyond the city edge here. Looks like corn. There's something out here. Something to treasure. Where are we at here? Okay, so we're we've reached this is the outskirts of arena. So let's turn around. Let's 
Let's see what we can find here. Sit go. Man, where do we go? <laughs> we uh came back quite are we are we in arena still? Where do we Man, we're jumping all over the place here. Alright. Let's go back. We'll kinda click. We're gonna drive really quickly here. Oh, yeah. There's the water tower. Okay, there's the gas station. Where's Grandma Mary's Cafe? Is it over here? Is that it? What's this? No idea. Okay, there's the sitgo. See, I warned you guys, this is a rambling video. But hey, we're checking out Arena. So for those of you who live in Arena, we're, we're checking out your, your village, your town. I don't know if I would call it a village. I'd call it a little town. It's a, it's a cute little town. A couple of cars for sale. Oh, I bet Grandma Mary's Cafe is over here somewhere. Um, I think we are reaching, no, okay, so we still have a little bit to go before we go all the way through here, what is this, okay, 45 miles per hour, we need to watch our speed. That looks like the school there's a motorhome over there <laughs> and what is this I don't know looking pretty open over here I think we're I think we're reaching the city limit it's like all blurred out Still says arena. Where are we at? Okay, so we haven't reached the limit yet, but it's it's out here. I mean, yeah, we're we're pretty much out there. All right, so how can we go back to our map here? So let's take a look at Grandma Mary's Cafe. All right, so here is a, a picture inside. They're closed. Menu, places.singleplatform.com. All right, so this is what Grandma Mary's Cafe has. They got breakfast, eggs and omelets, Wisconsin cheese. Your omelet is topped with your choice of real Wisconsin cheese. Denver omelets. Greek, meat lovers, Mexican. Yeah, that's your typical omelets. That's the typical prices. Collins Corner and Extras. The Brisbane. Two eggs prepared your way. The Dimby. Two farm fresh eggs your way. Ash and eggs. Two eggs. Eggs and potatoes. Granny's Big Breakfast. Pa's Biscuits and bra Bravy, <laughs> Grave Gravy, the McMary Sandwich. This, this is pretty much your typical breakfast stuff that you can find in a lot of different places. Uh, sides, appetizers, barbecue chicken quesadilla, but those are good. Seasoned chive steak fries. i go for that. Sandwiches, hamburger, cheeseburger, sliders, sourdough BLT, deep fried chicken sandwich. That'd be interesting. Patty milk, I love, I love patty melts. Grandma Mary's roast beef. 
catch of the day trio powder veggie burger Wisconsin cheese melt there we go for only four ninety five my goodness sounds like a good deal if you ask me Reuben I love Reuben's Reuben's are great dinners pork chops roast beef hamburger steak shrimp country fried steak liver and onions al dente sides all right so that's a you know nice little place um I bet the 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 environment inside is kind of nice and probably cozy uh does not gonna you know give you the impression of some big franchise or anything like that bob's barbecue emporium What's the crappy shop? Let's look at the crappy shop. That's the crappy shop. <laughs> there we go. That's the crappy shop right there. What is the crappy shop? Anyone know? Oh, that's that fireworm. Bolton. Bait and liquor. All right. Uh, that's the gas station. Arena Cheese. That just shows us the inside. Let's go back to Grandma's Cafe again. This is the inside. It looks kind of disturbing, actually. Looks like she's getting mad at someone. How dare you spell that? This is what it looks like on the outside. Oh, there it is. There's Grandma Mary's. What's this over here? It's like an old old vehicle. Grandma Mary's. All right. Maybe if I ever make make my way, oh, it's by the water tower. There you go. Look for the water tower. Look for the sit go. It's right across the street. There you go. Looks like the way to go in is right here. There's your cheese cheese store all right that's chucky e. cheese <laughs> isn't that the does that look like chucky e. cheese all right so yeah when you come through arena watch the cars make sure they don't hit you uh come on over here grandma mary's cafe get yourself some grub and go buy yourself some cheese fill up with gas and then uh Maybe say hi to a few people and before you uh, make your way to your next uh, adventure. <laughs> uh, there we go. So, yeah, that's kind of sad about the schools closing and arena. Um, that's sad. Small towns, they have uh, personality, I think. Anyway, what do you think about this uh, this article about schools closing are you in a small town where it's kind of shrunk and uh maybe sc schools have closed maybe other things have closed what are your thoughts um on that love to hear what you, what what you what you think um other than that thanks for hanging in there with me even through our little uh, road trip through arena and uh, I will see you on the next rambling video. Take care.